And for Virginia, they've got an opportunity to win it yet again and to win it outright. Jack Salt wins the tip for Virginia. The fifth time in the last six years. Under Tony Bennett, a lot of debate about whether or not this is Tony's best team. Kyle Guy has their first bucket. Well, the good news for Virginia is it's a close call. They've had so many good ones. Good drive. Five battles, played some point guard this year. There's Frank Howard, the senior in his final home game. Able to kick it back out, and then Frank Howard could shoot over the much smaller Kihei Clark. Well, those are tough passes right in the middle. Syracuse is ready for Hunter. There's a three for Ty Jerome. Before the Louisville game, he went to, they, they're calling him Golden Boy, his teammates. Brissett gets that one to roll in. Guy trying to post him up at different times, this time getting the ball and driving it with the left-handed finish over Golden Boy. Jerome is a guy who can get under people's skin. Didn't see him do anything to warrant getting in. Never an excuse to get elbowed in the head no, like no, no. that. Should have used the backboard, but you're not going to get one easier than that in transition. Now they've used Jerome a couple of times in the middle of that zone. He pops out and shoots a three. Jerome now in the middle of the zone. He passes it out and then moves to an open area for a quick three. He is a player. That's clearly a pass to Chuku by battle. Outstanding sixth man tried to flick it away and could not. And the turnover is really hurting Virginia. And a three by Hughes puts Syracuse back on top. 20 candidates for the Wooden Award. Well, he's a lot of country. He's a lottery pick. DeAndre Hunter is a, an outstanding player. And yet another three. Virginia, Sean, has not yet hit a two-point basket. Excellent at both ends of the floor. And as you said, Hunter likely to be a lottery pick. Battle strong. Drive, missed the shot, Chuku there to flush it, put Syracuse back up. Matthias Battle is a very good jump shooter. He has not shot well from three, but I think he's even better. Good recovery by Buddy Beheim to take that shot away from Kyle Guy. Beheim's freshman has improved as the season's gone along. Jerome buries a three for Virginia. Up just 54 points per game. And they've also committed the fewest total number of fouls in the country, 402 entering tonight. There's Battle penetrating again. Very difficult matchup to go against for Tyus Battle just because of the size and athleticism. Braxton Key, nice job finding a hole in the middle of that defense. He just slithered through, taking Virginia to the NCAA tournament for the sixth year in a row, adding to the school record. Buddy Beheim, you mentioned the improvement. He's really playing with a ton of confidence. It's remarkable how Virginia shot the ball from the perimeter. Yet another three. The elbow in the side of the head of Ty Jerome. Battle guarded by the much shorter Kihei Clark. And he took advantage. Clark is a pesky defender. Ball needs to move first before they attack the zone. Hey, Battle got away with a little shove to discard Clark. Chuku the offensive rebound and a foul on Mamadi Diakite. Offensive stops. Also off the offensive glass, Diakite getting an initial shot on Chuku. This guy has to be courageous. He stood in there and took a charge on our he first did. big Monday from Zion Williams. Zion Williams. Beheim hits the floater from the free throw line. Virginia not known as an offensive rebounding team. They usually send only two guys to the offensive glass, but they're trying to get back. Beheim. Right now playing with a lot of confidence and bounce. Eight points for Buddy Beheim off the bench. He averages six a game. Hunter gets hit by Chuku, and the shot drops as well. On the opposing team's point guard, he can handle it. 6'7", 225, Guy open for three. They continue to fill it up from long range. Kyle Guy with the defense to move and then get it there. And it has been Telegraph City for Virginia. Howard, and that's a three. Well, and his teammates, Allison, wanted to shoot it as well. They've been great confidence givers for Buddy Beheim in addition to that crowd. Two. <laughs> yeah, but you've not aged at all as a teenager. Time. Minute and a half into the second half. Virginia, the number two team in the country, down by four. Jerome knew as soon as he released the floater, it was off. He has it back now on the elbow. 
Kyle Guy steps into a three. Another three for Virginia. Ready to shoot. He catches it. You have to take that shot away from him. He is catching that thing to shoot it. Elijah Hughes for the kiss. Had several tonight. Diakite couldn't do anything with it, so Jerome found room in the corner and banged home another three. Two out of five from behind the arc. Tied for the fifth time. Uh -huh. Nice move underneath the bucket. And Virginia making some very intelligent choices the last several possessions. Set. Golajai. Open his battle. That's a three. He's moved past Dave Johnson tonight in the 16th all-time in career scoring at Syracuse. And his bucket answered by a three by Hunter. Guy at 6'10", he's 43 and a half percent, but he's only taking 24 all year. Diakite blocked at the rim by Dolajai, who's not getting up. Blocking that shot by Diakite, he has just now come back to the Syracuse bench. He didn't walk from the locker room on his own power. Diakite lays it in off another beautiful feed by Jerome. Could be 200 pounds. He might really be a force. Jerome, long three. Boy, it looked like he was almost on the edge of the big S at the center of the court when he let that one go. And the Syracuse offense stalls. And now they're going to spend some time on defense, give up a three. There's another three from Guy out of the corner. Too strong off the glass. He thought he was fouled. Tony Bennett did too. Howard tries to spin away from Jerome. Buddy Bay, they need it, they get it. Virginia has been brutally difficult to score upon in this second half. So Syracuse having to manufacture something in transition. They were scoreless for more than five minutes, and the response by Diakite. Points tonight. 1,617 for his career. Now 16th all-time at Syracuse. Another three. Kyle Guy. It's hard to beat, especially when you play defense the way they do as well. Hunter, the crowd groaned as soon as he caught it because they realized he was wide open. In the country right now, Mark Hughes' team, congratulations. And through their conference undefeated and winning by 27 points per game. They head to the conference tournament. They're the concentration of teams among the best in the country. The ACC is the best by far. <laughs> My goodness, and he was gesturing to James Breeding that he got fouled. Rome's five out of eight. Hunter's six for 12. Guy. Like, he, he catches every ball to shoot him. He doesn't assess things. He's catching it to shoot it. You'd better take it away from him. Elijah Hughes, a three. Games are on ESPN, the ESPN app. So you can watch anywhere. Obviously, both very important games. Kentucky and Duke, two teams with number one seed aspirations. Obviously going to talk about how well Virginia shot the ball in this game. But their second half defense was really terrific. And Diakite, a rare two-point field goal tonight. Bayheim told us earlier in the year he believes Virginia is the best team in the country, and they look like it tonight. He told us before the game tonight, I would be very surprised if they at least don't make it to the Final Four. Wow, Huff's bucket. Man, it's incredible. That man, Tony Bennett, already, whether they win it outright or not, Tyus battle the bucket, entered this season. Uh, this year, and that's it. That's incredible. Cody Statman on the floor, number 23. <laughs> nice block shot by Jaden Nixon, a freshman who hasn't played very much. And they Brand can play. Dad, Jess Kersey, the great NBA ref. His uncle, Brian Kersey, hey. the supervisor of officials in the ACC. If they win uh, Saturday and North Carolina loses any one of the uh, next two games, they're going to win the ACC regular season title outright again.